I can't wait to play this fucking game. I've been waiting for it for 20 years. Have, Have you? you really? I've been the biggest fan of Samurai Jack. Have you really? No, I've never seen it. Have uh, you really? Yeah, no, that was. Or, sorry, yeah, I'm not yeah, old now. I, I am. I am old, but I am not old now. World is old, but game, I am no old. This has been getting insanely good reviews. Has it really? Yeah. I no. think we should just do a few trees, not too many trees like that. Yeah, that's yeah, too that's many that's trees. That's far too, too many. Too samurai, I'm a samurai. Whoa. I remember this. That's the beautiful babe. Oh yeah, this is like the end of it. Yeah, this is the end of the show. That's really w so it starts of this? Starts it. Why am I speaking like that? <laughs> it starts of this? It starts of this? <laughs> With a wench materializing, no less? This happened at the start, but it is the end? Is he dead? No. She's so hot. And he never will be. No, well, I mean, I don't know about never. Your father. No, you're not my father. Yes, I am. No, you're not. <laughs> You know what that implies? That a coup did a big J? If you could do that with your hands, would you do it? Fucking all the time. What would you use that to do? To anything. Scratch Open boxes, scratch my ass. Yes, yeah, scr that'd be the best. Scratch ass. Chris's ass. <laughs> Dig it. Dude, deep I'd just in be my belly button. <laughs> I'd just yeah. be handing them out. All you guys would get ass scratches. I don't care if it's fucking weird. If I got the ability to do it and I can pass that around, you know? Now, if you had a sweet katana like that, what would you do with it? I freaking love Aku, he's so fun. Yeah. You almost don't even want him to die at the end. You just like, I'd I'd kick it with that dude. Oh no. <laughs> Whoa. Ah, uh, it's the video game world. <laughs> A different realm no less. I am 3D now. I actually kinda like that uh it starts here because the end of the show actually blew shit. Yeah, yeah I didn't like it either. It seems like they rushed it. They should have split the last episode into two episodes. They should- I felt like such a big idea. Yeah. It- it, it's, it was like really well paced at the beginning of the season, and then it just like went at the very end. Yeah, the first three episodes are great. Yeah, I they think. are. How come Jack has white people name? It was given to him by those aliens. It's given to him by Joe Biden. In, in the show. Come on, man! I'm come on, man! Sent, come I on, Jack! Sent, I got sent to the future. Come on! I say, Rothschild. Why is Brian Griffin here? But I saved you in the future. Rothschild. He knows this animal's name. It's the dog. I must put an end to this madness. This is cool. This game uses autosave. Good. That means I can do this without fear of getting my game corrupt. Okay. This That's is great. <laughs> Okay, there's that, that. You can dodge, you can jump. Cool. Alright. That's me. That you? That's not you. That me, I'm dithering. That me, I'm <laughs> dithering. <laughs> Dithery Jack. <laughs> You'll never be cool enough to dither in Ooh. real life. That would be a horrible insult to say to somebody. Dude, all the fucking bullies in high school now pick Ryle, on other kids. you will never dither. Never! Yes, I will. Someday. Someday, when I'm stronger than you, I will dither. And I spent 26 years being close to the wall with a camera, Ooh. just hoping it would happen until finally... It happened, you dithered. Yeah. <laughs> Look, Red Rocks. Red Rock? Red Rocks! Have you ever seen Samurai's, uh, Samurai Jack's Red Rocket? <laughs> <laughs> He's got it in his little sleeve. It's a Red Rocket in the last episode. He's so excited fighting Yaku. He cuts off his too. arm and he's like, NOW I HAVE DEFEATED <laughs> YOU! And he grows no, a little- not my Red Rocket! He grows a little not prehensile Red, red Rocket yeah. and it wraps around his sword and stabs a coup. All, all, all of the people Jack saved in the future all get Ooh. Red Rockets and attack, uh, <laughs> like, they'll stand around him. They're all in handcuffs, but their <laughs> Red Rockets all come out in unison. Aku's <laughs> one, one biggest flaw besides that sword, his biggest weakness is Red Rockets. Foolish Samurai. Red <laughs> Rockets don't work on me. Is this the best game I ever played? Yep. Is it? Do I you think, like I think it? it is. That's what, that's what uh, your review of this game should be called. With you going, ha, and the, and the thumbnail. <laughs> yeah. Have, is have this you, the best game I've ever played? Have you shrugging, <laughs> but also with a shocked face? Yeah. Yeah, have both. 
Like yeah. wh- which w- which one of those faces does? I want to have a smug face, my fingers on my chin, me scratching yep. my head, me yeah. crossing my legs. Oh yeah, you got to be looking upward diagonally. Upward diagonally. Up yep. I should be balding. I should be fucking. You should have my like, face should be pink. Yeah, you should have a pink face. You have sh- <laughs> the contrast should be turned up. You look really pale and pink. I've got bags under my eyes. I'm crying. My dad's in the background with a belt. Your dad's in the background with a belt and no shirt on, like walking around. He doesn't even know he's on camera. That's the best thumbnail I've ever heard. <laughs> Why don't the other guys do that? Because they're too afraid. They're too Fucking afraid pussy. to ask the real. They're, they're afraid to put all the things together. Yeah. That's like crossing the streams for YouTube thumbnails. They never, yeah. <laughs> but when it happens, though, that video will become the most viewed video. I like how the insinuation of your dad shirtless with a belt, like lumbering around your hallway, is like a behemoth that goes by smell. He's coughing, a bit, <laughs> looking for like some batteries or something. Yeah. Where do we keep the AA batteries? What do those red rocks do? Uh, you eat them and your tongue turns red. Those red rocks must be from an episode. That's him chopping them up. It's him thinking about the episode. Did this actually get good reviews, or did you lie to us? I might have lied. Oh. Did you really? I might have lied. I have heard positive things about this game. It got one out of ten on every single- Got one out of ten? <laughs> yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, no, everyone hates it. You wanna know why? Why? Why is this hated? Because it's about, uh, this guy, he's dressing like a samurai. <laughs> and his name is Jack. So which one's the truth? Does this game get good reviews or does it really get one out of ten? I'm gonna it, level with you. I don't believe I It didn't get those. any reviews at all. Everyone ignored it. Alright, that sounds the most believable. <laughs> Everyone Nobody's said this game looks so average. Really we don't want to waste our time. About this game. Yeah, that's why we are gonna get all the money from it. Yeah, exactly. You're gonna make Jack commit Hajime Mosh Day if you keep fucking talking like that. <laughs> What'd you say? You heard that's me. Some racist word. What was that? No, it's it's like when they uh when they they put the little boxes and not every word is Konichiwa, dude. No, no, this is uh. Goes on Chris, those are your crabs running to your, to, to your balls. To my cock. Yeah. <laughs> to scratch it for me. <laughs> it's so itchy. Crabs, a shot ball! Crabs! If you had crabs, but they only itched your balls when they got itchy and didn't make your balls itchy. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait, you're saying they make your balls itchy, but they also Ooh. scratch your no, balls No, no, they you? don't make your balls itchy, they just scratch they, your balls when they get it itchy. They only scratch your balls, that's the only side effect of crabs? Yeah, but they, they also live on your balls. Why would you not want to get crabs then? I actually don't understand. That's like having a, a thing on your back that only scratches your back when it's itchy. Yeah, but they're they're on your balls, you gotta remember, yeah, so... Yeah, they're only helping me. Yeah, but they're, they're watching. They can watch all they want. If they're scratching my balls, they're helping me. So is this like the new canon for for this show? They just put it in a game? I'm not sure. Yeah, it feels like a continuation. Yeah. Yeah, I like how they rendered him. I like how they rendered him in Continent. I got a Smash Ball. The continent? Yeah. You say where he is right now? In yeah, well, in a continent, yes, where, but also where? in continent as in he can't reproduce no more. <laughs> oh, I see. You're saying he's got an inability. Is that not the right word for it? Uh, Incompetent. No, well, no, it would be I mean, incompetent. Ster- would maybe sterile. get sterile is also yeah. one. There's a maybe, different word maybe for that it. Is, though, I've never heard that used. You're Scientific right. current term is cumless. Cumless. Yeah. yeah, they rendered him cumless. That's cumless. The cumless dog. Uh, Samurai, <laughs> Samurai Jack is sans cum right now. He's he lacks cum. I must go back and find Ashy. Did you see a portal anywhere? I have not seen it, but I did see the Scotsman in the swamp just ahead. <gasps> the Scotsman's cool. He says, Ashy, check my elbows. I son. remember liking him. Did she check my elbows? <laughs> yeah. Well, it would be on his elbows. Ashy elbows, dude. Oh, oh, he has ashy elbows. Yeah. So he tells Ashy, look at my ashy elbows. To, like, that's a bonding thing. Yeah, exactly. Whoa. I think she would like that. You have That'd very ashy elbows. <laughs> One of the best pickup artist things you can do is tell, show girls your ashy elbows. Yeah. And say, this is because I'm salt of the earth. Except for I'm beyond salt, I'm ash of the earth. Yeah, you say, uh, you, you be Mary-Kate to my ashy. We're like sisters. Let's make out. And they do. Well, yeah. I mean, well, what about <laughs> fellas like me to, who don't have ashy elbows? Like, well, they, you're they can, just shit out of luck. I got bubblegum elbows. What does that mean? They're pink. <laughs> From what? From being white. And oh, bubblegummy. Uh, sure, I mean, I guess you I guess you could show somebody your bubblegummy elbows. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> My bubblegummy elbows. Whee! Oh my Jesus, God. that was nice. That felt good to do. So, uh, this is like, Missouri, right? Yeah, this is, this is, uh, this is definitely Missouri. I love these, uh, backgrounds. 
Uh, doesn't that just peeve you off? Can we turn off? this off? This is scary. It's alright, man. I, look, I'm gonna hold your hand, okay? I don't think that'll help. Okay, wait, Lyle, hold my hand. Alright, yeah. Right, okay, now let's, we can go back into it. Are you sure? <sighs> alright, that, that's, that's easy, okay. Where yeah, baby, now! What if J Jamurai Sack's new catchphrase was Bad Baby Down? Was Bad Baby Down? <laughs> yeah, Bad Baby Down! That'd be awesome. I, th I think I think it would have gotten about 10 more seasons if that was his catchphrase. I feel bad for that Gandhi to Skinksky or whatever the fuck. Whatever the fuck his weird name is. Why do you feel bad for him? Because he made this cartoon and everyone hated it. Uh, people did like the last few- I don't think anyone hates the whole show. No, every everyone- everyone hates everything he's ever made. Oh yeah, that's the case now, yeah. It's really sad. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not true. I feel like if I met that guy, I would just completely just shut down and not be able to say anything. Why? I don't know, because he, he like, he was my childhood. Everything he made, I loved. Yeah, he's... He's also, he's got a great, uh, eyeball for stuff stylistically. Like, uh, red hair. Red stringy hair. You say him? You're gonna be him? Yeah, he's got red stringy hair. He's got red stringy hair, he's got bugged out eyes. He looks like a rag doll. He's missing every other tooth. <laughs> <laughs> he's and got milky eyes too, by the way. He's got the Bill Cosby milky eyes. Does he have the milky eyes? He's got both. He's got two milky eyes. He's got to be brought around by his handlers all the time. Gandhi the Skinksky. Yep. He's got a he's got a robotic voice. <laughs> he does have a Robotron voice. He, he's missing all of his fingers. He's that guy from South Park. That. Mm, what are you doing? Oh, dead. Yeah. <laughs> ah, that hurt. Stop. What Dude. is the point of making a robot a crocodile if it's just gonna shoot you with a gun? <laughs> I, don't I don't know, that's a good question. <laughs> Whatever idiot guy made this in this world, I guess. I'm honestly kinda... I didn't know Adult Swim made games like this. This is cool. I don't think they usually do. I think this is... pretty uncommon. I used to love their online games back in the yeah, day. Yeah, I feel like they only made Flash games before. I could be wrong about this, but... I mean, can you guys think of any other shows that were like... Adult Swim shows that did this kind of thing? Not really. It'd be cool if they brought back Metalocalypse like this. As a game? Yeah. I think they were working on a game at one point. Really? Yeah, yeah. There, there was like really early footage of it. You played as one of those, uh, the Clocketeers. Oh. <laughs> oh, you mean like the the guys? Yeah, they're little like executioner dudes. I see. Aqua Teen Hunger Force has a few games too, but it's, all, it's mostly like golf games and shit. That's fucking weird. Yeah. I mean, maybe there are none golf. I just remember specifically there was like a PS2 Aqua Team golf game. I don't know, do- do these kind of shows ever translate to a decent game, though? I feel like the Family Guy one that sucks. That was horrible. Hard. The fucking future South, South Park did really well. Yeah, uh, okay, yeah. But that's because the creators were involved, I think. <clears throat> oh, fuck. Ah! Did you just rip your sleeves off? I did cool stuff. Come here, stupid. I did a little power-up. Did they just curl back? <laughs> What was that? Your sleeves, Your they just sleeves. grew yeah, they back. back. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know he had a magic robe. I he's, guess he does. He's like Joseph in the Technicolor Dreamcoat or whatever. Didn't that what guy get eaten by a lion? Joseph? Yeah, he was like, I'm gonna go in and fight this lion and God's like, to teach you humbleness, uh, you're gonna fucking die here. I don't know. But I think what? a guy does get eaten by a lion. And then his coat just turns all red. I always oh. thought Joseph, Joseph and his Technicolor dream coat was Mary's husband. Wait, she got it, around. Wasn't the point of that that they were like jealous of his coat, so they like beat him up and shit? <laughs> wasn't that the point of that story? They spat on his coat and threw it in the dirt and made it brown like everyone else's. This isn't related to Samurai Jack at all, but can anybody out there tell me what bird this is? He goes. The cuckoo. It's not the cuckoo. The chocobo. It's not the chocobo. The chocobos like, go. What do they really do? Woo -hoo -hoo, woo -hoo, they like yeah. <laughs> Here's what a real bird does. He goes. <laughs> Think about that. Oh, that's the North American uh, wakatu. The wakatu? What does yeah. it eat? What does his diet consist of? Grass and beans. Worm, and trash. <laughs> trash, garbage. <laughs> swamp juice. Oh, uh, yeah, swamp mucus. Swamp mucus, uh, sewage. Literal shit. Uh, uh, deco uh, only decomposing, like rotten meat. Oh, I remember this guy. Do you? Yeah, from the yeah show. he's cool. Did you say yo? Is it the story with this guy that he actually doesn't like Samurai Jack originally in the episode and then he grows to like him at the end? I think so. I think the episode with this guy is that one where Jack becomes like a weird raver at the end of it and starts doing like rave karate. Yeah, I think it is, yeah.
Would Jack really do that, though? Yeah, he had to. I think he do. I think he do do that. Eat the haggis. This moderately restores health, and it's two thousand freaking dollars. That sounds way <laughs> too expensive for what it is. Repair. Okay. Can I repair that? Is it fine? I don't think the sword would ever break. Okay. And if you dare to insinuate otherwise, you don't know your lore. Lyle's gonna freak out. I once told him the sword breaks and he once uh, turns the brightest red I've ever seen anybody turn. Actually, doesn't it? I forget what the fuck happens to it or why he doesn't have it. Ooh, I got more gold. Get more gold! Freaking gold! Someone animated that pose and thought it was so fucking cool. Somebody stood up from their desk and said, what did I just create? <laughs> Whoa, what's that? What is that? That's that Will of the Wisp. Can you slash at it and it'll do something? No? Is that not where you came from or something? I think I gotta go back, cause all that's down here is you that guy. Go back? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like in Samurai Jack. Yep. Wait, yep. what is this shit? <clears throat> I... I don't know. Oh, look, I'm wanted. Well, is that's that That's nothing me? like you. Yeah. Replace, repla wait, go back and look at that? Huh? Replace that with Chris's actual face. And put my SSN under it. Your <laughs> Took me a second. Wait, I can go up here. Wait, we should explore more. You never know what you might miss. Look, this, a box and barrels. This toilet water you're running through looks so delicious, doesn't it? It this does green look green toilet water. It looks scrumptious. Because all none of these people have plumbing. Look, it all just falls into that water right there if they take a shit in their house. An elegant solution for sure. <laughs> That's your paper that you wrote, an elegant solution. <laughs> yeah, an elegant solution. What was that? What was that one famous thing about eating people? What? It's the famous thing, but it's called like uh, Go on. an inconvenient proposal or something. <laughs> what the fuck is it called? Whatever. It's like that. that but that's Lyle's sequel. <laughs> Lyle, are you gonna eat people? No, he's gonna eat poop. <laughs> he says, "Look, here's the equation. We have more poop than we have people, <laughs> and we're all hungry. <laughs> Therefore, we eat have you the ever... people and save the poop." Yeah, exactly. And then you bubble. can make little little uh, terracotta friends out yeah. of the poop. <laughs> And I don't that's, want to burst your brown bubble. I don't want to burst your bubble right into my delicious lips, but... <laughs> little adobe... I don't want to burst your brown uh, bubble from golems. your ass to my lips. <laughs> but here's the deal, Buster. But! Like but, like a human ass. Yeah, but... Where are we going with this? I don't know, man. It was kind of gross, and I think everyone in the audience just got sick to their stomachs. We're going boldly into the future with this. That's we're where we're going with it. We've been doing a lot more feces and shit-related stuff lately, and, uh... Oh, that's You him. say that like you didn't walk us into the Sally. No, definitely. It's been wild. It's been spearheading, and I've been trying to tug us the other direction. You sure, know? you've been tugging on something there, Buster Brown. It's not my you-know-what because you're talking about feces. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, it's voice actor John DiMaggio. Is it really? Yeah, it's Bender. Yeah, and he's got a Sonichu medallion, most foul. <laughs> he's gonna stick it up his ass. That was a weird Samurai Jack thing right there. He's like rotoscoped or I mean, motion capture. I think he is, in certain parts. I love how this fucking guy looks. Yeah, this game looks great. It looks like, uh... Oh no, that hurt! Ow, Samurai! He's kicking your ah, ass! Ah, he's shooting me with his pubes! <laughs> block, block, block! Oh my Christ. Yeah, that wasn't very fucking good, was it? Okay. Come on. I know a lot of people here don't have faith in you, but I believe that you can do this. I think I'm actually the best gamer, uh, apart from, like, maybe my dad. Or DSP. D he's pretty... He's pretty powerful. I mean, ah. He's won, he's won several awards. Uh... The award for the only person to ever have, like, jacked off on Twitch. <laughs> oh, come on! He's not the only one! He's a prestigious... <laughs> ...respected he, member oh. of the community. Well, he I, I don't hold it against him or nothing. He didn't invent it, but he certainly pioneered he certainly, it. Yeah, he certainly <laughs> popularized it. I think it's kind of cool. Oh, no, I'm gonna die. I will say, when I streamed on Twitch, I was so paranoid about doing that, that every time I would stop streaming, I would, like, restart my computer immediately after, just on the off chance that, like, for whatever know, reason, I'm sure like, that's happened. People were for some oh, reason it looked like their like their program was uh, like not live still, but they were somehow. Whoa. Yeah, I was I was ultra paranoid about that. I told you about that one time where I was streaming and then my laptop died that I was streaming on. Oh fuck! And then uh, I was like, okay, whatever, and I just ended the stream because my laptop died. But uh, I went into my bed and I was about to jack off. And I was just like shuffling around. I plugged in my laptop to charge it back up. And then, uh, fucking, <laughs> I got a text message from Jules. It's like, hey man, just let you know you're still streaming. It's like, what the how fuck? Long, how long were you offline for? Like five minutes. So, wait, how was the streaming if your laptop died? Uh, because I want to plug it back in and it turned back on. Even though the, the lid was shut, it acted like it wasn't. It acted so, like it so was open. So, people just heard blackness for yeah. like five minutes? Yep. 
That's so, fucking scary. So yeah. you were laying on your belly with your legs off your bed, about to do your. I was peeling my foreskin your... back, picking the smegma out, about to get ready. You were peeling your cock like a banana, ready I was to pouring go. vegetable oil yeah. all over my fucking Johnson. Tell. Oh shit! And uh, I was making, I was inspecting it for cancerous like lymph nodes. Yeah, <laughs> like lymph nodes. <laughs> And then I suddenly, the, jo the doctor checks under your penis pit uh, for your lymph nodes. Yeah, thank thank God for Jules. Everyone would have, I would have been the only other DSP ever. Thanks, Jules. Yeah, Jules is actually. I think we all have a story where Jules has stopped us from showing our penis publicly. Really? Can we show like? Uh, can somebody go over that picture of Bill Clinton, and JFK, or even like Trump and Reagan, and replace their heads with with uh, Jules and Chris? 